A suspect is dead after a police-involved shooting in Bushwick, Brooklyn. Investigators say officers were initially responding to shots fired outside a liquor store. And then after discovering three people wounded, officers chased after the gunman. CBS 2's Andrew Grimes has more. The front window completely shattered at Boardwalk Wines and Spirits in Bushwick. Police tape covers the area. Remnants one day later after gunshots rang out here at Halsey Street and Wilson Avenue. Not surprising for Ezekiel Manny Kelly, who lives down the block and says people often gather here. They are sitting in front of the, in front of the wine store in the car. And the car drinking. And if you walk outside, you see all the bottles because there is glass every day. Police say officers nearby heard gunfire around 10 30 Thursday night, got out of their car, and saw three people shot in front of the liquor store. Cops were told the gunman ran around the corner on Wilson Avenue, so they took off after him. Body worn cameras were activated. I have reviewed the footage. They observed the man holding a firearm in his left hand and gave commands for the man to drop the firearm. The man does not comply and instead raises the firearm in the direction of the officers. The officers then discharge their service weapon, striking the gunman. Police say this is a picture of the suspect's gun. He later died at the hospital. As for the three people initially shot and injured, police say they're all men ages 27, 39, and 40. Sources say it appears they were hanging outside the liquor store, but there's no indication the shop was the target of a robbery. Police say they recovered three guns at this scene. Friday, neighbors walked by with children and their dogs as the NYPD continued investigating. This longtime resident says he's often on guard. Anything is liable to happen out here. This is Wilson Avenue. Anything that can happen. Right now, it's unclear exactly what led to that initial shooting. Police say none of the officers involved in this were hurt. In Bushwick, Brooklyn, Andrea Grimes, CBS 2 News.